So I came into the Medicare industry from banking. I had been in banking for quite a few years, um, had worked in the sales side of banking, and honestly, I just felt like I was not having any positive impact on anyone. Um, I was uh, basically getting credit cards and loans and those types of things secured for people. So it was helpful to some point, but it was also creating a pocket of debt um, a pocket of things that I really did not care to continue working with them. Um, I had a few friends who had left that industry and gone into the insurance industry on the Medicare side. Um, this was in 2014 that I decided to make that transition. I went over and got my license. I did not know anything at that time about Medicare, except that people over 65 had Medicare. After meeting so many agents who were independent in the field, it was interesting for me to see how many did not have any local support whatsoever. Um, I'm speaking with agents who have worked 20 plus years as an insurance agent and still every year is trying to figure out what the next step is after AHIP, what the next step is after certifications. And it was a little concerning talking with some of these agents who I've been meeting with and ask him, well, well, who do you reach out to? And they say, well, I'll reach out to the carrier, I'll reach out to them. The thing with Advocate Health Advisors is they have an in-house agent care team, an in-house client care team, and local support. That is enormous. And their local support actually answers your calls. We are there to take you every step of the way from the time you license all the way through to your first sale and beyond. That really resonated with me when I joined the Advocate Health Advisor team.